It's the final resting place for generations of Tampa families, but someone's been trashing the historic Marti Cologne Cemetery. People who have family buried here are outraged by this vandalism, and police are on the case now. Fox 13's Kylie Jones joins us live now. And Kylie, you talked to a woman who says this isn't the first time this has happened. Yeah, Chris, she has several of her own family members buried here, and unfortunately, she says similar things have happened in the past. One of her own family members' grave sites was victim to past destruction. The city says it appears this person is coming out either late at night or when nobody else is around. I have both sets of great grandparents on my father's side buried here. The Marti Cologne Cemetery holds generations of Missy Martin's family and decades of history here in Tampa. People just want to come here and visit their family members and, and keep that tradition going and just be safe when they visit here. But the place where she and hundreds of other people go to mourn and remember their loved ones has been violated. We see vandalism from time to time in cemeteries. Uh, this is a very specific vandalism type with um, some messaging and some very coordinated efforts of one person, we believe. Tampa Parks and Rec Director Tony Mulkey says it's ramped up over the last week. Staff say photos show graffiti on walls of the mausoleums, a flame set to items inside a mausoleum, and staff say it appears the person even climbed up and vandalized one of the rooftops. It's more egregious at a cemetery because it's a solemn place. It's, it's a place that people go to uh, pay respects to their loved ones or their family. Mulkey says they've sent maintenance crews out to clean up the mess almost every day. Martin says, unfortunately, this isn't the first time this has happened, but it's worse this time. This cemetery is over 100 years old, and it's got um, some of the founding families that immigrated here to Tampa and helped settle Tampa and make it what it is today. Tampa police are investigating, and in the meantime, having more officers patrol the area while they look for the person responsible. I think people just yearn for peace for their loved ones, and that's it. That's all they want. And also the city has the city says it has been looking at additional security measures to potentially put in place and keep this from happening again. But of course, if you see anything or know anything, they ask you to report it. Chris. Kylie Jones live for us tonight from the historic Marti Cologne Cemetery. Thanks, Kylie.